I'm about to go for lunch and I have an exam in exactly 25 minutes. <laughs> I've spent the past three weeks traveling, so preparation is nearly zero. So let's see how this goes. All right, we're back. First day of term, fresh start. Feels like forever, cause six weeks is really too long for a holiday. Don't think I quite like that. New things this term, we have like, so instead of CAD, we have drawing, which is basically CAD, but on paper. I think I'm still not gonna go to lectures like I planned to last term. We'll see how it goes if I stop going from the start. Since today's the first day, I'm still gonna go. Just see everybody, say hi, get like the admin stuff over and done with. And we'll see how the rest of the week goes. Hey Raja, okay, how do you feel about mocks? How do I feel, bro? I want It's making a mockery, literally a mockery of our entire life here. Uh, my mocks, which was like my own college one, it was better than expected for someone who didn't study for three weeks and then had to rush the last week in college. No, oh, I, I, ex I expected that nothing and I still formed it. Okay. The only saving grace I have is that there was one question, uh, one of our instructor's questions, which actually was a past paper oh, the question. Last one, the, the, the tra so my friend and I signed up for a hackathon yesterday on web development, which I have zero experience in. It's gonna take up the whole of the Saturday tomorrow. So, let's go ahead and win it. What do you feel about our yeah. hackathon? Well, I haven't done much of it, so it's really your creation. But you know what, it looks, it's looking great. It's looking 10 out of 10. I would play this game. <laughs> we got ours to work after, after seven hours of nothingness. So that was the hackathon. Obviously, we didn't win anything. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, after that, my dad came and visited after five months. And he bought a load of stuff for me from Singapore. So we got our solid haul of Indian snacks. Shout out Chakli, shout out Bakarwari, yeah. These are not what my dad got me, but these are snacks for Chinese New Year, which is going to be celebrated tomorrow, which should be exciting. Tomorrow is actually so packed. I have Chinese New Year celebration with my Singapore Society family, and then I have Chinese New Year celebration in the college, and then I have formal. So probably zero work is going to get done tomorrow, but whatever. It's only been two days into term, and it's already so busy, but I'm loving it. I love the fact that we're all back in this rhythm, and it's super fast, and it just feels good to be back. Well. Tonight's the start of term bop and I literally don't have anything that matches the outfit for the theme. So I'm just gonna wear my Moroccan jalaba that I bought. And hopefully it's, hopefully it's not, hopefully it doesn't seem too out of place. Just past 12.30, way, way, way past my bedtime. But honestly, it was such a fun walk. Like, this, this was the first time I didn't drink and get wasted or tipsy. Sorry, mom. <laughs> but it was so wholesome, like, seeing everybody else get wasted and seeing all my friends again. And, yeah, it just reminds me, like, how much I love school, I love college life, I love all these people. They're so, like, ah. Uh, such a homely feeling. But yeah, good end to the week. Well, rather start or whatever. Another thing, why am I standing and not sitting down? Well, I lost the thing that I connect to my camera tripod. So effectively, I, my tripod is useless, so I can't connect it to my camera. So until then, I'm gonna have to do this. So bear with me. Today is Chinese New Year, so gotta represent the Chinese New Year colors. Let's go for lunch. All right, wait, which is the chair? All right, oh, you got chairman <laughs> Mao lamb. Pork. Oh, pork, pork. <laughs> pork bread. Chairman Mao. Okay, now you explain it. <laughs> I am chairman, wait. No, let like you explain what you have. What do I have? What do we have? What do we have? Okay. This is chairman Mao pork belly, chicken fried rice, yang zhou fried rice, <laughs> and what's this? The Xinjiang, this Xinjiang, Xinjiang spicy lamb. The what lamb? Xinjiang. Like the... Oh my god, we got a cake! 
Hey! Switch out in front of the camera now. Okay, okay. The vlogs normally go like this. Yeah. This is, this is what the camera sees from behind. Hey. Why is he facing away from me? Wait, that's a boy. <laughs> yeah. Huh? So the camera can see. It's not for uh. you. <laughs> what wish do I make? I have no more wishes left, honestly. Okay, okay. wait, 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 wait. Can I go? Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, gosh, oh. How are you cutting them now? Okay. Yeah. Oh, what are you doing? I'm going to all of you. There you go. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you, thank you so much. Jermaine, wasn't that event a resounding success? Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to everyone who came. If they do or don't watch this the video. The one cat's person. And the one cat's person. Very poor turn out <laughs> say cats. So I woke up this morning to gym as per usual. And I checked the weather. It was freaking minus 6 degrees. Why? So I just came back from the Cambridge Union and we had Russ tonight to come and talk to us. And it was so annoying, there was like a fire alarm, like literally 10 minutes into the... There's a fire alarm going off. And Russ is right there. <laughs> Say hi! But after that, we all waited for like half an hour for the thing to settle down and then we went back in and I got a picture with him, I asked him a question. Sorry about that, camera died randomly while I was recording. But anyways, I asked him a legit question and then I f***ed around a little bit. Uh, I asked him if he could pay my school fees and <laughs> he said good luck. Um, but yeah, no, uh, I also asked him uh, how often does he take time to reflect on his career, where he is in life and readjust his um, future goals and um, yeah, he, he gave an interesting answer, he was, he said he does that really often um, and that it's important to always be aware of what's going on around you and where you are heading towards in life and to always readjust that based on you know, if something's going right, if something's not. Um, yeah, he's a really spiritual person, really inspirational, and just a great guy. I'm really thankful to have gotten to see him. And yeah, that's the first week. <sighs> and my timetable is super busy already, and it's it's literally just started, but I'm loving it. I'm loving the routine, I'm loving the rush of everything, the fast, fast daily routine and fast lifestyle. This is so crazy. I just won the draw to buy tickets for the Olympics in Paris for next year. I'm so excited. I really hope I get to go. I really hope my friends are down. And oh, it's gonna be such a blast. <laughs> The real fans, all the real fans still waiting outside for us. <laughs>